let y'all know about the vital signs in the sky. Now, what are the vital signs in the sky? And what is a vital sign? Let's break this down to you. We want to step into this first to make sure with evidence, in fact, that electricity is one of our main components would give us, which give us a spark of life, okay? So, um, what is a vital sign? A vital sign is your pulse. Check your pulse. If your pulse is beating, you see on the movies, I go check a person's pulse to see if they're dead or not. So, that is a vital sign. Your heartbeat, that's a vital sign, okay? Anything that gives a sign of a transmission or a signal that's being sent, okay? Which is usually a negative and positive charge. So, let's say, for example, a person gets shot, right? And then they're almost... Uh, dead or whatever or they actually die a little bit or whatever and the um, ambulance come and I forget what they call them things but they run them that uh, thing together them jumper cables I guess to say and they say clear right and what they're actually doing is that is a negative and positive charge it's just like jumping your car battery right so we're sure that the electrical spark is the life-giving spark is the electricity which is the fire which is the light okay we sure about that now now that we know that let's go into the next phase of this okay so when I say vital signs in the sky we're talking about the lights in the sky which is proof and evidence of electricity which is proof of the spark of the eternal life because you can't kill energy or electricity you can only split it you see what I'm saying? So, so yeah, so we know that that is the light that we have in us. It's light. So when we're looking at the sunlight, the starlight, and all that light, remember those lights is what give life to everything here, right? So those are the same lights. So if those lights, because like if the sun don't come around, right, all these plants will die. Everything that you know of as life will be gone. You see what I'm saying? So, um, so yeah, uh, so the lights in the sky is proof and evidence of your vital signs, which is, let's talk about the vital sign part. Think of a Ferris wheel going around like this, right? Okay, well, there's four frequencies that go into, that, that's coming from the earth in and around it, from out the universe through the earth. That frequency is what give everything life here too, right? So, so uh, think of a miracle round and think of a person that got shot, right? And they're almost dead and they're clearing them. So, when that person, vital signs on the machine say, mean they fell off of the miracle round frequency okay and I'm gonna try to make this more clear for you guys to understand it okay so look okay so the frequency that's going through here see everybody like to think that they're all on their own energy I like, you know my energy is my energy his energy but no it does not work like that because we know we're all breathing in the same air right so the miracle round goes through the whole earth all of us are connected to that frequency. That is our vital sign that says beep, beep. So that miracle round, it's got all of us up at the same time saying beep, 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 sending that signal through here life, right? So um, when someone is almost dead and they do it and they 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 they're trying to charge them back up, trying to give them a jump. They're trying to get them, their body, because their body just fell off that frequency miracle realm. So they're trying to get their body back on the miracle realm, the frequency that's flowing through here. 
which is that 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 pulse is the universal pulse is the earth's pulse it's not just your pulse and that's what they got you thinking <laughs> you know what i'm saying you got you thinking oh well my pulse is my pulse and his pulse is his pulse and you, it's easy to think that because you know our, 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 our hearts are maybe i'm not sure but they might be different beating at different pumps or whatever but that doesn't change the life signal that got us all the heart charged up from the signal you see what i'm saying so um where is this signal coming from where is these signals coming where is these uh, uh transmissions coming from well these transmissions are sent from the lights in the heavens you see what i'm saying so to be clear to let you know that those lights in the heaven are your vital signs those lights in the sky so those are the vital signs in the sky you see what i'm saying letting you know that you're plugged in you're plugged in man you're plugged in and you are the shining one and that's what i mean when i say you are the shining one is that we're all connected right until we go against those lights in the heaven we need to understand that the light in the heaven is the sign of eternal life. You know what I mean? And uh, just to point it out, they also put it in a movie too. I've seen uh, Will Smith, right? Will Smith uh, on Hancock movie. At the end, he put a, the heart on, on the sky, on the moon, right? He put the heart on the moon to let you know that, you know, it's the vital sign you know, of life, the signal that gives spark and life to the heart. You know what I mean? He put that on the moon to let you know that that light of the moon is the signal to the heart. So go watch at the end of Hancock movie at the very end. Will Smith's up there and he sent the symbol of dude and he let him know that uh, pretty much, hey, you know, I got your back, you know what I mean, or whatever. And he pretty much made him famous, his symbol famous or whatever. But the whole, the whole metaphor to that is letting you know that that light is the proof of the light that sends your heart the signal that give it its beat it's proof facts you know and the reason why i'm putting this out here because i believe that everybody should know this because the truth is is that you can actually go research and discover and retrieve this information but you got to get it you know, a little up there with your reading and a little up there with your uh, deciphering words because words are really codes, you know what I mean? You got so much more inside of a word than one thing that's in there, you know what I mean? Like light and life and fire, you know what I mean? All of that's the same thing, you know what I'm saying? So wherever there's light, there's heat, which is fire and electricity, all of it's the same thing. But they separate everything too. And with that being said, I'm going to add on something else too that they also separate up too. They separate God, so, so, so God, heaven, love, truth, all those are the same thing, man. Same thing. Heaven, love, truth, spirit. You know what I mean? All of us the same thing. And remember that everything is really one thing. So I can split something up to show you the parts of it. Like, I can split a person up and be like, well, he got his brain and his heart and his liver and his lungs. But the thing is, is that really a person. Yeah, so really a person is many things working together as one. And their spirits being magnetic. Bringing together everything. So when the body die, it start decomposing and start going in its own way. Because of the magnetism being absent at this time. You know, so, yeah, keep that in mind, too. But, yeah, uh, the whole reason for this video is to let you know that your vital signs are lively, are signs of life, vibration. So, vital signs are electrical, and they are set by the electrical signal, magnetic signals you know what i'm saying so when you understand all that for what it is you understand that you know you are not this earth see because everything on this earth is is the earth so my flesh is of the earth my spirit ain't of the earth you see what i'm saying my spirit is of the space you know what i mean i'm space born and two 
a body of the earth. You know, so this is a um, this is a uh, organism, which is both supposed to represent the shiny one, right? So when you look up at any lights that's up in the heavens, pretty much, and you see lights, the other word for light is life, which is we know light.